What Panama has shown more than anything is that there's one rule for the rich and one rule for the rest. If you've got a lot of money, you put it in a tax haven, you get a big income as a result of it, you pay no tax on it. If you're a care worker, a street cleaner or a nurse, you don't have those options, you don't have those opportunities, you pay your tax. And I tell you, the anger out there of a lot of people who work really hard, yeah. pay the tax and not uh, offered negotiations with HMRC, they have to pay and they get fined if they're late. It cannot be right that we're just allowing people to shift resources offshore in order to avoid taxation in the UK or indeed in parts of Europe with uh, the rather strange behaviour of some companies such as Google that move their billing arrangements to a lower tax regime in order to avoid UK tax and many others as a result of it. There has to be a chasing down of this principle that seems to operate amongst the super rich in the world that some or other taxes for somebody else not for them this is an international scandal Let that the panama papers have begun to uncover i believe it's the tip of a very large iceberg and i tell you people that are seeing their local services cut people that are seeing their health services in any country under threat get very angry when they see the super rich not paying their way